I'm Ian Driver and you probably know me for some, as someone who's always uh, digging out and exposing the negative things at Thanet Council but today I actually want to talk about something that's marvellously right and absolutely brilliant and, and we're at the Garden Gate project just outside of uh, Margate uh, and it's a centre that's been here for 15 years it's, it's like a little secret garden that's been here for about 15 years uh, where, where people with mental health issues and learning disabilities can come and work and relax and, and enjoy themselves it, it's really is a secret garden it's amazing and it's open to the public and I can't sing its praises loudly enough or passionately enough it's really a tiny little piece of paradise beautiful gardens uh, it does a fantastic job providing respite and activity uh, and, and a place for people with mental health issues or learning difficulties to meet other people to develop friendships support networks get some experience of working with a, with a fantastic caring team Paul is the manager here uh, and it was his idea he was the founder and what uh, an amazing visionary person Paul and his team are to set up something like this it, it's just astounding so I'm saying that councils can get it right Thanet Council and Kent County Council who have been involved in the setting up of, of this project who have been involved uh, especially Kent County Council in the ongoing funding through social services they're actually doing a fantastic public service here and, and I suggest if you ever get the chance come to the Garden, Garden Gate project come and have a look uh, come and have a cup of tea, meet the team, meet the people who, who, who come and use the centre on a regular basis because there the, the really needs to be a lot more facilities like this across Vanek 